Well, hello again, everyone. Professor Prophet coming to you from Gamblers University, and we've got what may well be the best roulette strategy of 2024 for you. And this is one I'm very excited about. Uh, this is uh, one of those that starts off with just small coverage, small bets, and then we kind of spread out across the board and increase the bets as we go. So if you like those type strategies, you're going to love the triple nickel. Now we call it that because we have three sets of bets and we have five bets within each one of those sets. Uh, and that's when we get to the maximum. We have no more coverage after that. But I think you're going to enjoy this one. And I think this is a uh, very profitable one for you. So uh, I hope that you'll enjoy it as much as uh, I think you will. So we're going to head down to the felt here shortly. And before we do that, though, if you like this strategy, if you like this video, we ask that you give us the thumbs up. And that way we know you're enjoying the content. Also, if you haven't already become a subscriber to the Gamblers University channel, we'd love to have you go ahead and push that button and become part of the student body here at Gamblers U. So as always, we suggest you try these strategies on your software at home or on your table at home before you take them to the casinos. Be sure you're comfortable and confident betting them and that you believe that they will win some money for you. So. Let's head on down to the felt now. We'll show you the nuts and bolts of the triple nickel, how we bet it, what the progression is, and then we'll see if you agree with me and think this might be the strategy of 2024. So we'll see you down there shortly. Okay, everyone down here on the virtual felt getting ready to spin the triple nickel roulette strategy. Now, this is a $1,000 buy-in, which means our win goal will be $100. Now, the way we start this off is with uh, $1 bets on three single numbers, though in this case, the, uh, the 1, the 5, and the 7, and then a $5 corner bet on the 2 through 6 and the 4 through 8 here. Now, if we lose two times, we'll come back with another uh, setup just like this and say the 14 through 18 for 5, the 16 through 20 for 5, and then the 15, 17, and 19 for 1. Now, if we miss uh, <clears throat> if we miss again twice, two losses, then we'll come back. Well, first of all, we will uh, double these. Then we'll come back with the third set, and this time it'll be two dollars on the straight up numbers and ten dollars on the corner bets. So when we finish up here, uh, we've got three sets of five bets, and that is why we call it the triple nickel. Now, if we lose twice again, then we'll just double the bets. No more coverage. This is all the coverage that we're going to have. And once we get to our session high, we'll go back down to our base level, which is the first set of five, bet, five bets. So let's go ahead and clear this out and get started. And let's just use these same numbers, uh, five on those two corners, and then one on three straight up numbers. And just be sure that they all connect. <coughs> And we're spinning. Here we go. So that's a nine red. So that's going to be a loss. So we're just going to rebet. We're not going to go up just yet. We're down 13. And this is kind of a volatile system, which is why we have the $1,000 buy in. That'll give us plenty of room and plenty of chances to uh, hit some big numbers here. We do have some jackpot numbers, of course. So that's our second loss. So let's come back uh, and we'll do the 15, 17, and 19. And then the two corners in between those. And that's uh, two sets of five now. So right now it's the double nickel and the triple nickel will be where we max out. So there's an 11 black. So that is another loss. That's our first loss at this level. And we have to lose twice at each level before we go up again. And that just gives us more shots at hitting something. So 22 black this time is a number, so uh, still not doing well. So let's go ahead and rebet, and then we're going to double these bets, and then we'll come back with uh, two corner bets for ten dollars each, and then we'll do the three uh, straight up bets for two dollars each. And this is all the coverage we're going to have now. This is a seventy-eight dollar bet, and uh, we're also down by 78, so let's see if we can get a hit here. Six blacks, the number. And that's going to be a partial hit for us. That's a $12 win. So we'll take that. That kind of gets, gets us off the schneid. 
and we're spinning again. That's three red. That should be a good one for us. It is. That's an $84 win. And so now we are up 18. That's a new session high. So we'll just start over on our progression. And let's move over to the 6, 8, and 10 this time. And then, of course, the two corner bets in between. And just form that straight line there. $13 bet. And let's see if we can hit one here early. 30 red is not going to be uh, good for us, so that's a loss. So again, that's our first loss, so we'll just rebet and spin again. And that's 17 black, so that's going to be another loss. So now we'll rebet, and now we'll pick up the uh, middle numbers here. Let's go 18 or 17 through 21 and 19 through 23 corners. And then the 18, 20, and 22 straight up. So that's a $26 bet now. And we're spinning. There's 14 red. And that's going to be another loss. So that's our first loss at this level. So we just rebet and re spin. And there's 18 red. And that's a big score hit for us. That's a nice one. It's a $55 win. And let's see where we are now. That's 21, so that's a new session high. So let's start back over with our uh, base level. And let's go back to 357. And then the two corner bets in between. $13 bet. And let's see if we can get on a roll here. 29 blacks, a loss. So let's uh, just re-bet. That's our first loss at this level. And we're spinning again. 21 red, another loss. So that's going to put us back in the uh, red again. So let's go ahead and re replace those bets. And then we'll bet these two corners. And then the 15, 17, and 19 straight up $26 bet. <clears throat> Down five for the session now. So there's nine red. And that is a loss, so let's rebet and spin again. That was our first loss at level two. And that's 32 red, so that'll be our second loss at level two. And so now we'll go to level three, and that means we'll double these bets and then pick up some numbers here in the third uh, dozen. So let's do two on the 27, the 29, and the 31. And then the corner bets in between, we'll do 10 each on those. So back up to $78, down 57 on the session now. Let's see if we can hit a big one here. 25 red. That's going to be another loss. So that's our first loss at this level. So we'll just stay where we are and spin again. So there's 11 black. And that's yet another loss. So that's our second loss at this level. So now we'll go up uh, one level. So we'll add $5 to all the corner bets and $1 to all the straight up bets. And this kind of keeps it from getting out of hand too quickly. With our $1,000 bankroll, we still have a little room here to start hitting some numbers, although we are down $200. So we would like to hit one or two here pretty quickly. So there's 18 red, so that will be a $18 win. So that's a start. So let's uh, spin again and see if we can hit a jackpot number and make up a lot of this loss. <clears throat> so there's eight black, and that's another $18 win. So we'll just uh, rebet it and spin again. Down 177 now. Six uh, black is the number. And so that's another $18 win. So those begin to add up a little bit. And we're spinning again. 17 black. And that is a jackpot number, $261 win. Wow, that's a big one. And just like that, we're at $102. And that is our session goal. So that kind of gives you an idea of how quickly... Uh, you can come back on this, even though we were running badly. We finally hit a jackpot number and uh, achieved our se session goal. So we're going to go ahead and keep playing. If uh, I was in a casino, I would be walking away right now. 
But uh, since this has been a pretty short video, let's keep playing and see if we can keep winning some money. We start over at our base level. And let's spin, see if we can hit a number early here. So there's the uh, big green monster. So that's a loss there. We'll stay at the same level. And we're spinning again. There's 11 black. So that is a $32 win. So you hit them early, those are pretty big wins, even the corner bets. And that puts us at 121. So we'll just re bet and re spin. We're back at zero losses now since we're at a new session high. And there's 12 red. So that is a loss. So we'll just re bet since that's our first loss. And 24 black will be a loss, so we'll, uh, that's our second loss, so we'll pick up another five numbers here, or five bets here. And let's go those two corner bets, and then pick up the 18, 20, and 22. $26 total, and let's spin that wheel. Here's 30 red, that's a loss. So we'll just come back with the same bet, that's the first loss at this level, and spin it again. Here's eight red, or eight red, eight black. So that's a jackpot number. That's another $100 win for us. So that puts us at 169, a new session high. And we'll go back now to our base level, $13 bet. And let's spin. Fifteen blacks the number, so that's gonna be a loss. So we'll just rebet. It's our first loss at this level. And we're spinning. Two black. So that's a $32 win. That's a nice win there. It puts us at 188. That's a new session high. So back to zero losses. And we're spinning again. We'll just rebet. So 28 black, that's going to be a loss. So that's our first loss at this level. So let's just rebet and spin the wheel again. There's three red. So that's going to be a nice hit for us, a $68 win. And that puts us now at 243. So we'll just rebet and we're back to zero losses now since we're again at a session high. 24 black will be a loss, so we'll just rebet. That's our first loss at this level. And spin again. 20 black, that's going to be a loss. So now we'll go up uh, and add another five bets to the board. So let's go with the uh, 1418 and 1620 corners. And then we'll come back with the 15, 17, and 19. Straight up, $26 bet. And there's 10 black. So that's going to be a loss, so we'll just rebet. That's our first loss at this level. And here we go again. 33 black. That's going to be another loss. So that's our second loss. So now on to the next level. So we'll rebet. And we'll add uh, $1 to the $1 bets, $5 to the $5 bets on those two. And then we'll do the same thing. Uh, we'll put $2 on the three straight up numbers. Let's go 27, 29, and 31. And then $10 each on those corner bets in between. So I'm back at a $78 bet. And we're spinning. So there's four black. So that's going to be a $12 win for us. We'll take it and we'll rebet and spin again. 26 black. And that's another $12 win for us. So we'll take that. And once again, we'll just rebet and spin again. 18 red. And that's another $12 win. So that puts us at uh, 201, our session high. 
is 243. So let's uh, just bet and spin again and see if we can keep hitting these $12 wins. 23 red. And that's going to be a loss. So that's our first loss at this level. So we'll just rebet and spin again. 14 red. So that's a $12 win. So let's rebet and spin again. Here we go. 35 black is the number. And that is a loss. That's our second loss. So now we need to go up another level and we'll add $5 to each of the corner bets. And $1 to each one of the straight up bets. And if we lose twice, we'll just do this again and keep doing that until we hit our session high. And then we'll go back to our base level. So 27 red, that's going to be a good one for us. That's a $126 win. That puts us at 183. So let's rebet. Our session high is 243. So if we could hit that again, we would be there. 24 black, however. And that is a loss. That's our first loss at this level. So we'll rebet and we're spinning again. There's that 24 again, so that's going to be another loss. So we'll rebet and go up to the next level. So let's add one to each one of the uh, straight up bets. And five to each one of the corner bets. And I'm glad this is happening. You can kind of get a feel for the volatility here. Uh, we were up uh, 243. Now we're down 51. And so let's see how quick we can recover here. There's five red. So that is a jackpot number. That's $348 win. And that's how fast you can recover. So we're going to go ahead and do this one more time and then call this a session. So let's pick up the uh, five nine and the seven eleven corners. And then the straight up numbers, the 6, 8, and 10. And as soon as we get to 300, we're going to call this a video. So there's 8 black. And that's a jackpot number. That's a $113 win right out the gate. And just like that, we are at $410 profit. So that is how the triple nickel works. And as you can see, it's pretty volatile. Uh, we went from 243, then we were down 51, and just like that, a couple spins. We had jackpot numbers on two in a row, I believe, and that put us at a $410 profit. So we started off at $1,000, ended up at $1,410, a $410 profit using the triple nickel. So we do hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, we ask that you give us the old thumbs up, and that way we know you're enjoying the content. And that also helps the uh, algorithms on YouTube and helps them um, recommend these videos more often. So if you would do that, uh, it would be very much appreciated. Also, if you haven't already subscribed to the Gamblers University channel, we'd love to have you go ahead and do that and become part of the student body here at Gamblers U. We generally do three videos a week on the uh, most fun casino games and discuss the strategies and just have a good time playing these out. So we do thank you once again for joining us and hope you'll come back and see us again real soon. Until that time, if you're out there spinning that wheel, we wish you nothing but the best of luck and we hope all your numbers come up winners. Talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.